everyone! So today I'm going to be showing you how to create some pretty copper and brown eyes, bronze, copper, whatever it's called, and some blue lips. So this is definitely a more out there look. It is probably not an everyday wear unless you are comfortable to go wear that then 100% I support you, you're good to you. <laughs> So yeah, this definitely isn't like a everyday wear that I would wear. Um, definitely the eyes I would, just probably the lips I changed to a nude or a brown or something like that. Uh, but yeah, if you guys want to see how I created this look, then please keep watching. So I've already done my foundation and my eyebrows. For my foundation, I used the L'Oreal Paris True Match Foundation in colour rose ivory and to set it I also use my Rimmel London Stay Matte Press Powder in 00 Peach Glow and to fill in my eyebrows I used my Anastasia Soft Brown oh, Brow Powder Duo so it just looks like that and now I am getting my Tarte palette the travel palette and I'm just going to get the bronzer shade to make my cheekbones stand out more. And then I'm just getting my regular brush and just softening that out just a bit. And then I'll also be getting a smaller brush and just taking the contour just to make my nose more sharp and slimmer. Blush I'm using today is by MAC in Style Frost. So it's just a pretty like sort of coral shimmery one. So now I am getting my Stila palette in Sol and I am just going to be getting this colour here to put in my crease. Now I am just getting some sticky tape to put on either side of my eyes. So I want to do it as far as the arch. So now I am going in with my Ben Nye Lumiere Grand Colour in Golden Apricot. Oh, if I can open it. It just looks like this. It is a pretty like bronzy colour with a nice gold shimmer to it. Just applying that to my eyelid. Now just going into my same Stila palette, I am taking this brown shade here. And now I'm just getting this black and I'm going to lightly put it in my crease just to make that just a bit darker. Now to just darken up my lid colour a bit, I'm getting my Tiki palette in bronzers. And I'll just be taking this shade here, which it's sort of like a dark gold bronzy colour. And I'll just be taking that on my finger and just placing it on my lid. The next thing I'm going to do is get my Stila palette and get this slight shimmery colour here just to put in my inner corners. Now I'm getting my gel black eyeliner in... Black Track 
by MAC. So now I'm going to take this off just so I can do my eyeliner a bit better. Now I'm going to go in with that same bronze colour from the Chi Chi palette on my lower lash line. And then I'll be getting the brown from the Stiller palette. The next thing I'm going to do is little triangles. Sorry, I didn't film that very well. <laughs> and now I'm also just going to put this on my waterline. Now I'm going to put some of my MAC false lashes in false black mascara onto my bottom lashes. Now I'm getting my premium eyelashes in T13. Okay, so the eyes are done. I am actually quite happy with how they turned out. Um, but before I go into my lips, I forgot where did I put it. I'm going to be putting my Mac Soft and Gentle onto my face. Oh. So I'm just going to put it on my cheekbones just to give me some glow. Um, and then on the tip of my nose. Now I am going to be getting my Rimmel London Exaggerate Waterproof Eye Definer in colour Deep Ocean. And I'm just going to be putting outlining my lips. And now I'm getting my NYX Jumble Eye... Jumble? Bloody hell, I can't even talk. So now I'm getting my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in 627 Cobalt. And I'll be applying this onto my lips. So this is my final look. Thank you for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see any more fun tutorials, well, sort of fun, but simple but weird. Simple but different. There we go. If you want to see any simple but different tutorials, then please let me know. And I will see you guys later. Bye.